Hey, glad to see you guys all back here on the motherboards.org YouTube channel. I'm Eric, your host. Glad to see you guys here. So check it out. Today, we're going to check out the Thermaltake Tough Power Grand 1200 Watt Power Supply. Now, this is one of these guys' highest end products. It can do either SLI or Crossfire without a problem at all. It features two rails inside of it. One rail is for all your peripherals and the other goes directly to your SLI or Crossfire connection. Now, it's a semi-modular power supply. Everything on is modular except for the power, the power solid. Now, there's been some debate about this and I guess I'll fold to you guys, sure. It does mean it's semi-modular if it doesn't have the power itself, but, you really don't want the power connector itself to have a modular connection anyways. By it being semi-modular, I think it's a better power supply and I'll explain why. The 24 pin power connector that goes in modular in any power supply has the chances of shorting out or disconnecting or causing any kind of problems with that connection. When the cable is already built in and steady, you have solid technology going through. Remember that solid technology, but you have a solid current of electricity going through and there's no other touching parts for it to short out at. So I think semi-modular is a better power supply than fully modular anyways. But anyways, let's go in and check out this one. I'm going to talk about this one right off the bat now. I'm going to talk about all the different things they have. It's a 12 watt power supply, has one 24 pin power connector. It has a single four plus four pin power connector for your other voltage. It has the eight pin plus 12 volt uh, CPU. There's a single one of those. Uh, four pin peripheral Molex old school styles. We have uh, actually eight of those. The four pin floppy connectors. There's a single one of those. For the uh, SATA connectors, there's 12 SATA connectors. And for your for your for your video cards, this is actually kind of cool. Kind of someone there. All the connectors, there are eight of them, are six plus two connectors, which means they can either be a six or eight by your choice, which is pretty cool. That's good for doing the two video cards. You know, some have a six pin, some have an eight pin, some have dual eight, some have dual six, some have six and eight. So that said, that's all that stuff in there. It's also an 80 plus gold certified power supply. When it's 80 plus gold, that means that the power supply is, is meant to run at its highest capacity for the longest amount of time. And it's been certified by this to do this by a website that does all kinds of power supplies in a million dollar lab. The box comes completely factory sealed in a nice shrink wrap package. We'll go ahead and start by removing the outside of the package. One thing to take note too is this Thermaltake Tough Power Grand comes with a long seven year warranty. Now, most people aren't even going to own their computer for seven years, so that's a very, very long warranty. Go ahead and pop it open. It's easier, just easier to lift the box out, let the power supply itself just drop out usually. That's about all that. Alrighty then. That out of the way. Weighs actually quite a bit. Most power supplies do. Let me see how this one's opens up. It just pops up from the top right here. Let me see here. Whoops. Okay, not quite really uh, getting today's unboxing there. Why are you not coming out there, mister? Okay. Kind of a little bit tricky to get that open there. That flaps pretty tight in there. It was actually pretty tight to get that particular part out. They ship this thing really tight. So we'll take a look inside here real quick. You can see everything comes all well padded and everything, which is good because in shipping things could get damaged. We'll go ahead and pull the unit out itself. We'll lay all the cables out here and stuff. Now earlier we talked about all the different cables. I'm gonna go ahead and lay them out there. And I can even break those down in the background for you. My camera can put all that stuff in. We edit the video and show you that. Also, every one of these cables is 50 centimeters long. For those of you who want to know how long they are, they're 50 centimeters long. Should be plenty of long inside your case. Fit all your capacitors and stuff. Oops, sorry, dropped something right there. Pick that back up. Little fan, little thing from Molex. Alrighty then, here are probably all the cables. Here's a manual. Here are some little clips right here that you can use for cable management. These are all good for cable management, all that stuff. Secure your cables. Little box that comes in so you can keep all your stuff in there. Oops. And then over here's another little box and there's some stuff inside of here. I'll go ahead and open that up and see what that is. It's the black bag. It's a black bag operation around here. Ah, just got some extra stuff for more cable management. So that's all really good. 
go ahead and leave that out there anyway so you guys can see and this bag keeps all this stuff in there probably hard for him to get all that stuff in the camera angle but we'll try and then we have the unit itself now one thing really take note of everything in here comes this really nice like black felt bag velvet felt it's a really nice feeling though soft makes it seem a lot more valuable just trying to open this up for you folks so we can see here all right so we said before it's semi-modular power supply as you guys can see everything but the power connectors is modular very well built unit you can see it's very nice i'll show you guys this back maybe we can get a little zoom in there and show that it's got nice fan for cooling got a nice on and off switch on the back very well built i'll just go ahead and set that down so basically here are everything on the table right here folks this is everything that comes in the new thermal take Tough Power Grand 1200 watt power supply. I'm Elric Ferris. Thanks for watching the motherboards.org YouTube channel. I'll see you guys back here soon.